I'm <laughs> alive! <laughs>
we drilled uh, I think it was 3 8 holes and these are kind of nice they're just press fit put these in the like this and then these pegs um, wedge in there and hold the foot in Someone on Twitter said that they canceled Halloween in this area because of the storm. I hope that's not true. But that's what I heard. It's kind of extreme to cancel Halloween, but... Okay, next up. Okay. Um, I've got all four sides on it, and I've got some mounts for my motherboard down here. They're just pine that I painted up that... Uh, are insulated of course and uh, I'm just gonna screw the motherboard onto them I've got my EL wire coming out the front of this thing I've got some switch wire and harnesses in there I've got my back uh, hole for the power supply cut out and uh, I've got my uh, mount on the back for the motherboard for the plugs so I was just gonna go ahead and put this motherboard in there now See if she lines up. Looks like it's gonna line up real nice. Don't want to use any power tools on this part of it because I don't want to break any boards. Just need it to fit in there. At least one more. Yeah, now that the first one's made, um if I should decide to ever make any more of these um, you know I've got my CAD program already set up and uh, most of my other settings are saved too so shouldn't be too big a deal to make another one if I decide in the future to do that and, uh, and I just may I may um, make another one later on so uh, I'm going to mount the power supply next. Forgive my big arm for being in here. I'll move it as soon as I can. Everything's lining up pretty nice. Um, there's a few mistakes on it. Nothing real noticeable, so I'm not worried too much. It's just for fun anyway. Um, but if I do make another one, I would definitely fix some of the problems that I see. But overall, I think that's no, pretty good. Come on, okay. I'm gonna do a little wiring. It's a tight fit. Okay, next up, probably the hard drive. Okay. Um, time to hook up the hard drive. What I decided to do is just mount the hard drive right here on the side of the case with four screws, just like that. So, um, that's what I'm going to do right now. I've already marked my holes and drilled. So it's just a matter of um, 
hook up the rest of these cables make it easier to mount if I do that now and then uh, just go ahead and screw it in and I need a power cable and it's not very thick plexiglass but I think it'll hold just fine just have to be careful that I don't stress it out when I'm putting these screws in because it will splinter I'm not careful looking good I'm gonna ream these holes out a little bigger I'll be back I felt like I I felt like I was putting too much pressure on these screws and so I'm gonna ream them out just a little bit I think that'll be better just gotta let the tool do the work so I'm not pressing or breaking anything there let's see what happens Oh yeah, well, that's better. Plexiglass, if you hit it just right, will crack so easy. So, that's what I wanted to avoid. I have a couple stick-on um, props that I got from the Halloween store, and I'm going to stick those on next, probably. What do you think? We have a few more too. Um, we might put them on as we go. We don't know exactly what we're doing. I don't know if you got a good view of the hard drive yet. Let's see here. There it is. All right, we'll be back. And we're just attaching this um, green LED fan to the top of the lid. That also came from this company. Um, shout out to them. Oxide.com. And then if it didn't work or it burns out early, you'll know who provided it. <laughs> we'll be back. Well, the day is finally here. Tomorrow's Halloween. By the time you watch this, it will be Halloween. And this is Frank and Cube. We stayed up late and got her done for you. Uh, I think it come out pretty good. It's a plexiglass, aluminum angle, uh, MDF board. Uh, it has a few problems, but uh, I think it come out pretty good. Got a little spider on there. Uh, there's some paper in here right now because we thought that the uh, the cutout looked better white. Uh, we could definitely take that out, but uh, I think we're going to permanently make it white somehow. But we did run out of time, so um, one thing um, I told you we ordered this uh, this light to go around here, and then the, the fan up here all in green. Well, the company sent us blue, and they sent us a green fan and they kind of was a little buzzkill for us but we still got it done so if the company's watching this we would appreciate a replacement uh, one of the unique features uh, that we did do first of all the hard drive got mounted on the side you probably see that in the build and then uh, we've got the plate down here for the uh, electronics out the back um, I wanted to show you how we start this up we uh, at the last minute we thought how are we going to put a power switch on this thing and uh, what we ended up doing let me plug this in here what we ended up doing is uh, these two uh, front pieces here that are made out of aluminum we uh, tied to the switch on the motherboard and then anything that contacts these together will actually start the machine so like um, you know this jumper cable for instance 
all you have to do is just touch anywhere and then it starts right up which is pretty neat you can see the green fan in there and this is the part that should have been green this rope light pretty disappointed about that but there's not much we can do it still looks good though I think and uh, so there it is um, comments are appreciated thanks for watching have a happy Halloween we'll see you next time hey guys this is Steve thanks for watching hey don't forget to subscribe if you like this video and be sure to rate and comment see ya